right, here we got this O2 Ford Taurus, and it's been giving us a lot of trouble with the power steering pump. We put a pump in it because it had no power steering, and uh, that pump failed pretty quickly within a couple days, uh, and again had no power steering. So we went for another pump, but it was really noisy, and uh, we were having a lot of problems getting it to quiet down. We noticed the fluid was really aerated, which it's not now, because we figured it out. Uh, but we looked up uh, the specific procedure, and uh, you need a vacuum pump, which we have, and it's actually a special service tool, um, which we don't have, but we kind of made it work. And the procedure is, we go ahead and we put a vacuum on the system, and then we start the engine. We're gonna apply a maximum vacuum of 20 to 25 inches of mercury for one to three minutes at idle. And so we did do this, it absolutely solved our problem. We were having a lot of trouble before, but, uh, this fixed it, and so we're gonna run through how we do it, right here. Here up. Uh, so, we had this cap, but this cap doesn't necessarily fit our reservoir. So we went and got a nice piece of foam, drilled the cap through the, drilled the hole through the cap and put a brake bleeder in it. Threaded that in, I did that when you weren't looking. And then uh, we could hold it here, but it didn't really seal, so we got our foam, drilled a hole in the middle of the foam, Put the foam on there, gotta get the cap back. Put the foam on it. And then if we center it, we start pumping our vacuum pump. It'll actually draw it into a vacuum and you can see the power steering level rise. It'll start to pull the power steering fluid up. Up, 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 up. And that'll start to draw the bubbles out. And so we're doing that with it running and then we realize, oh, we don't have time for this crap. So, we got our vacuum brake leader. Put that out. We made a nice flat right way. We did that for a few minutes with the engine running. Now we got a nice quiet power steering pump. No more comebacks. This was its third pump. So that's it. I don't know what other cars it works on, but at least some Fords.